there may be splitting of the skin in individuals with these types of burns. This splitting must be carefully evaluated in order to establish that it was not caused by any traumatic event other than the fire. Contraction of the tissues results from the extreme heat that was produced as a result of the fire. This is evident here in the larger joints of the legs. Observe fractures in the upper extremities of the small child, which resulted from the intense heat produced by the fire. It is important to remember to carefully evaluate these and any other fractures produced by the intense heat in order to rule out any possibility of these being trauma-induced. Here you can observe the contraction of the smaller joints of the hand that resulted from the heat. Observe the fractures within the bone that makes up the skull that occurred as a result of the intense heat. Soot within the mouth and air passages indicates that the victim had been alive when the fire was in progress. 